The big weather story though this week, yes, Hurricane Ian. It is going to be bearing down on the west coast of Florida over the next few days, and we'll go back to that. And you can see the center of that circulation moving over western Cuba. And a little later this morning, it's going to get back out over the warm, very warm waters in the uh, Gulf of Mexico. These waters in the Gulf undisturbed, so this will have plenty of fuel to get the uh, storm cranked up even more as it moves toward Florida. So right now it's a Category 3 storm. You see the uh, tropical watches and warnings all around the uh, peninsula of Florida right now with the hurricane warnings and watches there in effect. So a Category 3 storm now it's going to strengthen to a Category 4 and then slow down a little bit and start to make that turn right toward Tampa Bay, making its way on shore late Wednesday going into early Thursday as a major Category 3 hurricane. So this will be a major issues there as far as the wind, the rain, the storm surge flooding in and around Tampa Bay as that storm moves on shore. Then it, of course it will move on up the peninsula into the southeast and weaken. But again, this will be a major, maybe historic storm for the Tampa Bay area. Now for us,